Actually, what we don't know is that it's only the head of a vulture. Offside, you just see like a Kremlin like operating it like a puppet. I mean, considering how, how half these how half these creatures look, they may as well be fucking CG puppets. Oh, we're vulture just gonna culture. charge on ahead. All right, let's do it. I mean, honestly, why not? We're already by the, after we're done with this level, we're, we're gonna be at the halfway point. Jeez, yeah. you also oh, skipped I me. Just, I completely Ooh. forgot. About, I forgot my ditty. Ah, uh, hang on, first let me just do this. Uh, I thought that would be. I thought my ditty would be in there. You'll find a clone of me later. Oh, nice. Ooh. careful. Just play it safe. Get the barrel. All <laughs> kill the, the birds. little birdies. Ah! Oops. The little birdie killed me. I almost thought D. I part of me almost would have laughed if DK didn't get back up. And he just kind of sat there like he shot me. <laughs> <laughs> now it's Nate's turn. Oh where, oh where is my diddy con gone? Oh See, where's my good. little buddy? See this is what's oh, good. Nice. This is what happens when you don't abandon your friend. You get to tank Oops. shots like that and survive. Oh, oh never mind. <laughs> okay then. Friends to the end. <laughs> Friends to the end, even in even in they fall down the pit. The greatest gift in life's a friend. Merry Christmas, Donkey Kong. We Okay. Oh. It's a daily dividend. dividend. Whatever that means. What is that? Oh, he shot uh, it out It's first. from the Tom and Jerry cartoon. You know, it's it's from that song. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay, that guy, that guy is our bane. Okay, we are going to get past him. I swear. <laughs> We're gonna get past. If how we many? Game over, how many? How many baby vultures are we going to have to murder in order to actually see get our bananas back? Yeah, I, yeah. We we we're having such callous. The, the vultures can't be working for K. Rule. That's just us being ticked off at people. I mean, yeah. I mean, now that's not the thing about though. It's funny because like after this game, like the adult vultures literally go MIA. The babies take over from then on, from there on out. Right. Oh yeah, because these ones look, I guess, a bit more menacing. They just look so tiny, and, the, and, the, and then the long-necked ones are, like, there. Huh. Nope. That didn't work. Oh. Whoa, jeez. Wait, Diddy, you got some serious air! Yes. Oh, you okay. like? I've been practicing. Okay, give me the give me the checkpoint, come on. And hooey. Whoop. Uh, you know, with how bad we're- with how bad we've been doing the- this past- Past out, past half hour or so. I already dread once we reach the snow level. You know what? Watch it. Watch it do a 180, and you actually go through that flawlessly. I'll fucking laugh <laughs> if we do. Oops. Because this is I, I am I, I am actually I am feeling I, I feel fear. Also, Thanks. I just realized probably to play it safe. Let me yeah. just put a safe state here. Can't surprise fear. we can do that, but yeah, that. If in the event we get a game over throughout this world, because I don't want to have to go through world two again, have to have to literally beat another humongous vulture. Okay. There is That's... a way we can get lives fast, right? Uh, through the bonus games. Or is it one of those moments where, like, we... Oh, why do I keep doing that? Or is it one of those moments where, like, we are just gonna have to, like, get good or just Look. replay levels over and over again and hope to get, like, more... Well, I know you can find, like, <gasps> little... What? Bon I know you can find little bonus areas where you get extra lives. Oh, that's And right. actually, I just remembered... When they announced that this was coming to the SNES Classic, they revealed a couple of cheats that you can do. <gasps> Is that so? That's right. One of, I... go ahead, go ahead. One of them being a one of them being a, a little solution to your life's issue. What is it? Um, it's not infinite lives, but I think I think it pumps you for like fifty lives right off the bat. I mean that. Oh, but is it the kind of thing where you ha doing it? It just lets you start the game with fifty lives. It doesn't actually just give you fifty lives right on the bat, right off the get. Like right now, we couldn't just in input it to get fifty lives. I'm pretty sure you could. Oh. Well then, don't mind me looking this up for a second. Now, okay, what I'm gonna do? <laughs> wait, Diddy! Wait, stop! Go back. You can wait, jump. You can jump from that platform and land on that. Haystack right there. Yeah, you see? No, to the left. Yeah, over there. Oh, I see. Please tell me that's a DK barrel. No, well, it's no, barrel. It, it was, no, it was. No, that was a regular, regular barrel. Yeah. Dang it. If it was a DK barrel, it would have DK on it. Huh. Well, that's the that's the funny thing I've noticed is like whenever you actually spawn a barrel from those holes, it doesn't. It's not immediately obvious what kind of barrel it is until after it's popped out. A little grip spike limitation, but that's how it is. Okay. Huh. 
Where he does it. There you are. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yes. So now the score is. Oh. <laughs> well, how about how about we take a trip to the Ewok Village? Hooray, the Ewok Village, and I want that. I need a tiny. We are though. the e the beavers. E e e Ewoks. What was the? You 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 you, you, you freaking sounded like Bert singing the pigeon song. Well, no, that's that that's the theme for the Ewok cartoon. Oh God, I forgot they made any. I, I that I'm sorry, that actually killed me thinking about that. I forgot they made Oops. an Ewok cartoon. <laughs> What were they? What was the point? What was the purpose of the Ewok cartoon? How many episodes did it? Because the, get? I think it only aired for, I think it only aired for one season. As for how many, I will look into that for you. Okay, because that. I mean, back like then, a... back then, seasons were kind of an odd thing in the fact that well, usually they they could last a good while if they if the budget was there. No, no, that's okay, true. Like so... a lot, I know a lot of shows like a season to them will be like forty episodes. Nowadays, a season of a show is like oh, twelve episodes maybe. Okay, yeah. so here it is. Um, it lasted for two seasons. Ooh. Each one, the 26 episodes in total. Um, and here's something that I always forget about. It was co-developed by Paul Dini. Really? Uh, th th it was like like one of his really early stuff, because I think he also worked on He-Man. Really? He-Man! Well then, well, then I can see why they would... Oh, gosh. Then I can well then there I can see why they would want him because uh, oh, whoops, I did fired. Yeah, I, for, I forgot. I didn't think it was gonna like fire right away. Um, I can see then why they would want him for the show and why I'm sure in their head the math added up. Like okay, well I think this was like way before the animated series came out. This was before he got the reputation he had now. Oh, oh absolutely. Okay. <gasps> oh, oops. yeah, we have to get used to these barrels that are gonna try and trick us up. My, turn. you know it's. <laughs> It's so, it's, again, I did a test run last night, literally what? as I was half as, I was literally half asleep for it too, and I don't remember having this much trouble, then again, I also do vaguely remember using a few rewind tricks. Oh, we have rewind in this game? We do, but that doesn't, doesn't apply for online play. Oh, oh, fair enough. Huh? Okay. And, oh, jeez! Oh, oh, we get one freebie. Oh, thank I, I think we get one freebie. Everybody gets one. So careful. There you go. Okay, then comes a butt ton of them. Whoa. Woo! Yeah, don't make the same mistake I did. And now. Okay. And this is just my favorite level, the speed run. Now it's like, why speed run when you can easily fall off? No, I'm being very cautious here. Granted, I think I already mentioned this. I, I love the parallaxing backgrounds and what they've done with the place. I love this, like the Ewok. Apparently, there was a slight controversy in the Ewok cartoon because in the show they spoke full basic, which is the in-universe term for English. Whereas the Ewoks in the movies, they can't do that. Really? Oh. Well, no, no, they don't. They have their own English language. They, uh, English, they have their own Ewok language. Well, that's the thing. Like in the show, like they don't have that Ewok language. They actually speak English. Well, no, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's very... why. Go ahead, James. There, it's also the matter that you, it's pretty, you're pretty much hearing it from their perspective, so that's why they had to they have them speak English. I think, yeah, I think that's fine. It's not like they were talking to Han Solo or whatever, being like, hey, we need a drink down here. Yeah. It, it, it's kind of like, it's pretty much the Tarzan effect for those that actually watched that movie. Right. Do, 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 do. So, yeah, every, once you gather three three golden statues of one of your animal buddies, you get to play their respective uh, bonus game. And, well, obviously the trick here is that you want to grab a whole bunch of their little goldy things. And if you manage to get, get the gold one, uh, your current total is multiplied by spot in by two. That's actually Good incredible. Yeah. So now we got seven free lives. Yep. And we need them. Now, apparently. <laughs> apparently. We're going to try and go as far like... as we can without needing to use that cheat. Because I assume they may, do, they may pull some maneuver on us where you only get to use it once. Wait. Oh, what? James. Yeah, I know. It took us back to the last checkpoint. Oh, I thought it would have just planted us back where we started. Oh, oh wait, there's James. a band up there. <laughs> Why did we do that? Well, to be fair, we needed the extra lives. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I was about to say, when you die... Oh. When I die. Anyway, I was about to say, when you die, place. I noticed there was a straight banana that could lead you to a shortcut. No, no, oh, that, no that's just, just a bonus that, game. That was a bonus game we already did. Oh, okay. Then comes all of them. Woo! Oops. 
Wait. I can't step. Gears are turning. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I noticed we've dealt, used that term a lot recently. Well, I like the idea because it's just a general like wait, pause, hold on. I'm ripped. Gears turning. Oops. I'm screwed. And I the gears are stopped. I, I think you need to get. I think you need to get your gears repaired. Yeah, you know what really grinds my gears? When my gears grind. Ow. Except the Kong to the Kremlin. <laughs> just, and the Kremlin just hopped. Real life Peter Griffin here. You know what really grinds my gears? Donkey Kong. I do genuinely like that guy. Like the, the cosplayer and like the like the work that he put. Because he did really do a really solid job. And then apparently his wife got in on it. Because really? she can actually do a pretty solid Lois impression. Wow. Damn, that's, that's work on the both of them. So I. It's like if there, if ever there was a live action Family Guy, which let's be real, let's never have a live action Family Guy. But if there ever was one, call those two. I think I think they could. You say that, you say that as if he has the integrity to not do it. He's like, oh, I'm trying. No, he, he did actually make a joke about it in one of his old DVDs. He did make the joke of attempting to make a live action Family Guy, but it was all just a bit. That's fair. And then he. I mean, then, all, at the end of the day, that's all we really need. And then actually, it was kind of silly, or not silly, but kind of like. Wow, like, still topical and on the nose. He then made the joke about how he tried to, at one point, he tried Ooh. to, uh, nope. He tried to, well, we were at the end of the level, too. Jeez. Anyway. Yeah. He, he tried to, well, I'm, I'm not taking Funky Tom, I'm not taking Funky Tom. He there. tried to. He tried to make a version of Family Guy where they were all voiced by celebrities. <laughs> but it didn't huh. quite pan out, so you had people like, uh, freaking, um. Uh, did he? Yes, like people like Snoop Dogg were gonna play Stewie. <laughs> I, wow, okay. And it's but yeah, it's just it was one of those moments where it's like, you where it's like it's one of those moments where I'm watching, I'm like, yeah, I laugh at the joke, but people have been making that complaint that people are still doing this even now with things like Scoob. Oop. I thought I was gonna do the roll jump, uh, with things like Scoob and things like that. Like when you're when you just have a character played by a celebrity, thinking that it's gonna work out. To Scoop's cred, they at least had Scoop himself still have his, his uh, veteran actor. Right. Well, yeah, which is great. It's just not everyone else. And I mean, let's be real here. The same actor that's played Fred since the series' inception didn't get to play as fr didn't get to play Fred from the movie. Yeah, like I re I remember hearing that like Gray Griffin def took uh, like out of all of them, Gray Griffin took it the hardest since you know, oh yeah, she, no, was she, she was voicing Daphne for literally two decades by that point. Right. Yeah. And what's funny is that, like, apparently she actually was, like, close friends with, like, the original actress. No, I, I, huh. I imagine, and it's... I, I, mm, I can only speak of their, like, of that one scene they had in uh, Looney Tunes, but I want to say the original actor, Shaggy, and the new guy kind of were... They, they had an alright relation. They had an alright friendship, maybe? Yeah, they were fun for my, uh, for my hero. I mean, but considering that Matthew pretty much took up the helm as voicing Shaggy. I imagine that that uh, Casey Kasem was fine with it. Okay. Well, I hope so, considering he really was one of the only good parts of the movie. No, yeah, no, because oh, again... Oh, the, the older movies, actually. Because well, he had so much oh. fun, and, and clearly he had a lot of fun playing the character, and yeah, he has like, a fitting honestly, voice still. Honestly, I'd argue, like... What did you... <gasps> oh, boy. What? I was about did to... He? What am I supposed did to do he? in this situation? I think we'll take you back right. to it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, to, oh. Yeah, see? Okay, oh. I thought, I thought it was relief. gonna... I thought it was gonna just have me like, all right, did he? Okay. He, yeah, so. he never gave me lessons on how to climb the rope. Anyway, like I was saying, like um, oh, I get the balloon. Yeah, Lillard was hands down the best part. I still think at least a good chunk of the actors still pulled their weight on. Like I think Linda Carlini is actually a really good Velma. Oh no, she yeah, is. She's fine. And okay, careful. And I appreciate them getting that same guy for Fred, since it seems like him and Lillard had a prior friendship, being that they had been in a couple of movies prior to that. I recall yeah. he, he they were both part of some, I think it was Wing Commander movie. Yeah, yeah it was Wing Commander. Hype and I saw this part of our thing. Definitely hard to think of that as a video game movie since I never played the game it was based upon, but it was it was an alright sci-fi movie. Yeah, it's, I think as long as you don't have any real attachment to the source material, you'll find it fine. I thought the lion-shaped aliens were kind of neat, but yeah, otherwise it's, just, it's it pretty much felt like Top Gun in space, and that was about it. I mean, it's funny, too, because Wing Commander, from what I hear, tends to have a lot, or at least one of the games had a lot of um, FMV, live-action FMV cutscenes, and one of the, in one of the games, fucking uh, Mark Hamill was part of the cast. Yeah, he was. Which, I mean, is kind of funny in a way, considering it's for the game, as opposed to the movie. Oh, boy. 
Um, Hi, nice. I'm Diddy. You're probably wondering how I got here. Well, it's a long story about all Oh boy. It's a long story about my, how my buddy DK never tra never trained me how to be an actual video game star, and here I am! You're probably wondering how we got in this situation. And most likely Ooh. you're black! That was a close one. Uh, what do I do here? Oh, hit him. You jump, jump on, on the, the game. Clap trap. Yep, he'll spell bananas, and basically just collect the bananas and keep jumping on them, but don't run into them. Right. And he's gonna get faster, I bet. Oh boy, he's getting faster. Yep. Faster, Gary! Faster, faster, faster! I don't want to go faster. Patrick, the lid's already off. Oh. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> oh! Oop. Exactly. Not exactly like that. I know. Oh. I think that little monstrosity became an assist trophy in Ultimate. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's amusing. Actually, just speaking of, like, I, I mentioned it before, but it still bears repeating. Like, the video where Tom Kenny and Bill Fagerbake actually reenacted that whole episode. Like, when it got to the close-ups, like, Tom's was funny, but Run. the close-up on Bill Fagerbake, it looks like he's about to cry every time he does Patrick's voice. Exactly. <laughs> Seriously. Diddy, what are you doing? Run! I'm running. Uh, oh, that's right. You you're, gotta... not run you're not running. You're, spi you're, you're spinning in control. There you go. That's right. You have to hold Y. It's he's literally just Mario a... logic. Oh. He's just having a John T stroll. And he's just like... <laughs> 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 and he just walks away. Dude. Boy. Oh, he's got I, a checkpoint. It, it's, it, it's still amazing to me how long... Would, how, how far... How much of a disaster this has been so far. Well, we're still That's... pushing through it. We're not... Yeah, we we're still pushing him over yet. Oh! <gasps> yep. Yeah, that Jeez. might change eventually, but... Actually, I'm curious. The time, at the tone, the time is 50, 54 minutes. Yeah, we've been on this for a while now. Which is fine. I think, you... at, at the very least, I think we'll stop this half of the recording once we're done with this world. Because by that, again, we'll be at the halfway point by then. Right. Yeah, and I imagine, like, honestly, like, I'm still game for doing the whole game tonight. But once we get to our break point, I'm going to need to get something to eat. That's fine. Of course. Huh? Let me go! Let me go! Oh, there you are. And so Diddy ra outran, outran the, sp uh, the beaver on the freaking uh, freaking stone dime. Whose idea was it to give them the technology of the ancients? G g yes, let me... Let the me ancients the freaking... will not allow it. Let me save. Jeez, I don't think I saved. I pressed the wrong button to save. <laughs> One more Good. time. Let me get okay, back into so, Okay, hang on. Hey. First, you save. And now, James, you save. State. Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh, all right. Create save oh. point, not load. Fair, fair. May as well. Goodness me. You okay. never know. I, I, <laughs> if I, one save won't work, the other one shall follow. I am an idiot. By the way, uh, welcome to the orangutan gangs level. Home to <laughs> the, this odd side of the Kong family that hates our guts. Oops. After these they, messages... They, they hate our guts so devil they much, they don't want us to see them. But yeah, just Logan <laughs> saying that, I'm just reminded of that... It's, oh. it's probably one of my favorite old Bugs Bunny clips, but the clip I showed you of the giant where he's like, Well, he can't outsmart me, because I'm a moron. What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I thought that would have worked on him. I almost thought, for a second, it did look like your reaction matched uh, Donkey Kong's like expression of, I don't know, I could have sworn that would have worked, actually. Oh. Oop. Well, you got rid of the bee, anyway. No more steel keg, though. Maybe if I walk away and then come back, it'll respawn. Nope. Nope. <laughs> it Darn. forever died alongside that zinger. I was gonna do that trick where if you toss it at the wall and then like, and then jump off, and then jump on, oh hey, and then jump on to the uh, barrel, you can actually, uh, um, you can like oh, ride right. on top of it. I mean, is there, where, where was there, where, was there even a wall back there to even make to take advantage of? Well, there was the ledge that the thing was on, so if I threw it from far enough away, it would ricochet off of it, and then I could jump on it from there. I'm not yeah. sure if that would have worked, but I mean, I, I see where you're. Oh, there's a look who's up there. It's Espresso. He's looking it's at a like boy. Like, something about something about him and Diddy looking in opposite <laughs> directions. Like, what the hell are we doing? It's like, it's like you look that way. I'll look some other way. Roundabout. Now the main gimmick behind Espresso is that um. The main gimmick of Expresso is that, oh, by the way, oh. there's our uh, long distance cousins, the uh, Mickey Kongs. Uh, the, the gimmick Ooh. of Expresso ah. is that he can avoid the clap traps, well, that... even if you're standing. Oh, because his long legs. That and he can that and he can hover. Unfortunately, as far as I'm concerned, he, or maybe it's a she, I don't remember the gender. Oh, God. Is? Uh, is. 
crap, what else? He, she can't jump on... He, she, whatever, can't jump on enemies. And this is the only level you, you'll find her in. Real? No other level That's... in the game? As far as I can remember, yeah. Because, like, I, I... Again, I've done my whole test run the other day... Other de literally last night. This was the only level I ever found her in. And it's not like one of those weird things where, like... You know, kind of like the uh, Rambi's Rumble in DKC2 where it's, like... It's just like there he's hidden and you have to like go to a particular spot to uh, find him or Yeah, I think I mean maybe I think unless you manage to get the espresso tokens oh, you can't find I her anywhere else. I thought you can bounce on it. You can bounce on oh, barrels. I mean that be... Oh, it's vicious. But yeah, no, you Yeah, can. the Mickey Kongs are not ter The Mickey Kongs are very awfully jealous of the fact that we technically own the island. I thought his name was Rango Tan. <laughs> Rango Tan. No, they're called Mickey Kongs. Okay. They're the hillbilly cons with the ugly with the ugly teeth. Yeah, do not look up their 3D render. They are not yeah. pretty on the eyes. Uh. I mean, doesn't help, it doesn't help too that this was literally like the early days of Rare's silicon graphics experiments. Yeah. Careful. But um, other than that, I mean, I guess if there's anything up else to really say about them, it's in, I mean, there's some people that 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 uh, theorize that uh, their long distance cousin is Lakey Kong. I can really? see it. I mean, and I, I like the idea then from that where that oh careful don't jump on the barrels. I like oh. that the hard way. I like I then there I like the idea that like Lanky Kong's like a rebel or like you know someone who did who wanted to defy the evil ways and wanted to actually be a good Kong. Oh nice. boy, I I still love the logic of like Ooh. I can't believe the barrels betrayed me. After all I've done for you. All right, go espresso. espresso. I said go espresso. Oh. I was honestly oh. hoping you would come to a point where she literally stick her head into the ground. Oh, is that, an, is that? that one of her idol animations? I don't think it is, but I would. It feels like something that they would do considering oh, that oh, that age old myth. Yeah. And meanwhile, Espresso goes off to her beach resort. Beach resort. Never to be seen again. How are you doing, Greggy? Ah, it sort of takes me back seeing you here. How is it that no matter how far we just try to escape you, old man, we always end up back at your hut? Oh, bananas in the snake pit of the reptile rumble, all the way back in World One. On guard, the swordfish will help you get straight to the point. <laughs> I, 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 I have a question. Um, why does it look like we're back in World One, even though we're clearly in a different part of the island? Yeah, I again. don't ask questions you aren't prepared to hear the answers to. He's got us there. You know what? I, I also have to sometimes like, sort of coddle the line when it comes to like my putting on the DK cartoon show voice because I sometimes seep too far into the other end and make him sound like DDD. I I could see his act. I could see King DDD like filling in for honestly, I could see DDD's actor filling in for Cranky Kong if they ever wanted to like kind of like what they did for the 3DS that one time with Kirby right back at you if they wanted to bring oh, yeah. back the the Donkey Kong TV show for all for whatever reason just for one new episode you know what I uh, the, if they managed to br if they brought back the Kirby anime same four kids actors and all they should just swallow their fear and just do something like that with the DK cartoon that's what I'm saying just, I mean, for, I mean, just for one last reunion episode or yeah. something I mean, I, mean, I, I acknowledge you can't bring back every actor. Like, Cranky's actor, unfortunately, passed away. That's what I'm saying. So then that, so there, I can see the DDD actor filling in for him. Also, I forgot if the sharks here are called Sushi, or is that just Mario? That was Mario. Oh, Ooh. ow. Ooh. The, uh, the uh, sharks here are called Chomps, and there's also the little variants called the Chomp Juniors. How and cute. then there's these fuckers, the Clambos. I love, I hate when I get into this, I hate when the cycle is just like this. I'm like, okay, I gotta go. There you go. You gotta, you, you gotta, you gotta veer off the path of righteousness. Maybe if I take those pearls and make them into a necklace for candy, she'll stop being so cranky at me. Or is it mad? And then it just cuts to candy. She's wearing cranky's outfit. Anyway, so <laughs> I, I will. Please, please I also, no. I also admit more so than the GPA version. I thought the whole like, you know, using 3D animations as sprites here looked really cool at the time. Oh yeah, like this was like this was literally the game that revolutionized that that whole practice with video games. Careful. Literally using pre-rendered sprites. Right, and I think well, that especially for, especially CG's pre-rendered sprites. I remember hating this part too. Yeah. Oh god. And I think that was a very solid idea. And I think we're almost done. Just oh god. Just yeah. Ah, screw this. I don't. I don't even have all the other comments. Yeah, just forget about it. Just not worth it. Play it safe and let's get to the boss. There. Fine. Oh okay. no. That, is that the, the boss? Is that? Yes. Yep. Bumble that's the boss. Bumblebee Rumble. Yes, Bumble 
Okay, here we go. So here... It's literally a giant bee! Ah! The buzz. And of course, we're going to treat it about the same way as we treat all bees, but don't hit it when they're red. It's yeah. notoriously known that they are pissed off and thus invincible to all man-made destruction. Yeah, Careful. because it, as we all know, it's scientifically possible for a bee to change the yellow on itself. Dude, I would be terrified. The, the, the fact that it's changing color is what's terrifying you the most about the real-life probabilities of this insect that is trying to hunt us down. And well, the, the size goes without Bonk. saying. I'm just saying it'd be oh, funny if the color... The Nintendo Ruler 3s! It has betrayed us! Run! Oh, no! I, I don't think any of the other bosses go by 3s anyway. Oh. Not really, no. There. One less murder hornet to worry about. Yeah. ba da ba ba so yeah, with that said, yeah, we're pretty much halfway done. And next time, ladies and gentlemen, we're heading to the Gorilla Glacier, right up top DK's dandruff ridden air. I don't remember there being a factory on my head. I also don't remember having these big old horns. Why does my DK sound like DDD? Find out next time. <laughs> That's what I was saying. But yeah, tired everybody. I gotta go eat.